Let's go through the steps necessary to prepare to install the Core Archive connector. First, you will receive an email from OpenText that includes your new Core Archive for SAP Solutions credentials. Please note the public URL, which is used to install the Core Archive connector, connect to the cloud, and access the Core Archive service. Please also save the business administrator and user credentials, as you will need these to log into the service. To download the Core Archive connector software, please visit OpenText My Support. You can navigate directly to the URL shown on the screen or from knowledge.opentext.com. Search Core Archive Connector to find the Core Archive Connector updates. Navigate to the latest release, in this example 21.3.3. Here, download the Core Archive Installation Upgrade and Configuration Guide needed to install the connector, which is detailed in Chapter 6 of the guide. Next, download the Core Archive Connector MSI as well as the SHA-256. Once you have verified the MSI and SHA downloaded properly, navigate to your downloads, select the MSI, and drag and drop it to the SHA to calculate the checksum and ensure the MSI can be used later for installation. The Core Archive Connector is a service that runs on the Windows system and requires a user assigned to it that has rights to log on to the service. Under your Windows security settings, navigate to Local Policies and then under User Rights Management and Log On as a Service, Add the user who should be able to execute and run the Core Archive Connector service. Now your preparation for the Core Archive Connector installation is complete. Additional detail can be found in the Core Archive Installation Upgrade and Configuration Guide on my support at knowledge.opentext.com.